Welcome back to White Mountains Today. I'm here with Doug Garland of Bear Notch Ski Touring to talk to us a little bit about your current conditions, which apparently you guys survived the rain yes. and you've groomed through, and we have a good base of snow here yes. from Snowvember. Yes. So, uh, and what did you call it earlier? It was Superior? S superior Snow Management. S <laughs> superior Snow Management. Due to su <laughs> Superior Snow Management, they were, the, the conditions were salvageable. Yeah. And now you guys have amazing conditions for yes. the cross-country skiing. Yes, and that's what I'd like to let people know. I know it's a little hard to believe that because we had a really rough 48 hours of, of rain and stuff like that. Luckily, our base is already into 8 to 20 inches of snow. Which is insane. So, yes, from that's <laughs> November. You know, it was amazing. Uh, what it, it took a lot of patience. You had to stay off the snow or you would ruin it by getting on it too early. But we waited 48 hours, and then you could get on it just lightly at that point. There still was wet spots. And my brother, who's groomed there for what, 20 years since we've been open. Wow. Uh, I don't think there's another groom in the valley that's groomed that many times in Aww. the same place. So he knows, that he knows the network really well. Good. So what happened is, in the end, we got ended up with some superior conditions. It's unbelievably good. It's a, a loose granular powder mix. Uh, skiers come up, they call us all the time to see if we're even open because apparently the conditions are poor in some places. Yeah. Um, they call up, when they come up, they're absolutely amazed because our theory is to goose quality over quantity. Yes. Uh, and sometimes, well, in this particular storm, he had to groom the trails twice uh, to get them out to the point where we thought they were good enough skiing. Yeah. So our theory is we get it so good, you'd rather ski it twice. It's so nice you ski it twice. So you nice know, you ski it twice. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's it. Well, we have 15K, you know, and that's usually enough for the average skier. Yeah. But there are skiers that do more than 15 kilometers in a day, and that's what I say. It's so nice you'll want to ski it twice. There you go. And then you can do your 30 kilometers. <laughs> and you get your 30K in. And then you guys have soup and bread yes. waiting for you when you're done. Oh, yes. It's all, it, the soup's on, the bread was getting put on when I was leaving. And uh, it's, it's very nice up there today. It's, it's a very, very family-friendly oriented we really, space. really, really go for that thing. You know, the family, making memories for families. Aww. You know, you want to, uh, people are up here to have a good time. Yeah. And uh, we work really hard to make it look easy. Aww. But uh, it, they come up there, it's, it's very laid, low back, laid back. You yes. know, you go into a, an old farmhouse to get your rental skis. Aww. Uh, the outback and the warming stations where you're going to get your breads and your soups and you know, get candy and water and things like that. People socialize, you know, it's like you get to know your neighbor and, they, and then you go out and have a fantastic ski. That sounds amazing. I want to come play. <laughs> <laughs> and actually, I used to live not too far from you. You guys are right on the edge of the notch there, yes. going into Crawford Notch, because yes. I used to live in Bartlett. Mm -hmm. And so I, I saw your facilities a lot, yep. and uh, I think I'm going to poke down there. Well, it's a little bit of a snow belt. That's the yep. amazing part. It's that right at the base of the notch there, the snow sort of falls right over the Haystack Mountains, and it lays in on us. Yes. It also gives us a really good wind protection situation. Ooh. So on a cold, windy day, you, you, you get to go skiing anyway. Yeah. You know, and you, you stay right out of the wind. You go about five minutes and you're out of the wind and you, you forget about the wind until That's you come back. That's awesome. But conditions are just outrageously good now. That sounds awesome. And, and it's perfect got, timing, right? Yeah. So you got your family friendly, laid back mountain to, um, to make your memories with for cross country yeah. skiing. Yeah. And it's right after Christmas. It's for the Christmas holiday week. Yeah. And uh, I mean, you couldn't ask for more. No, it's economical. It's very good. You yes, know, we, for sure. Children under 16 ski, with a paying adult ski free. Wow. Yeah, so that's a really good deal. That's incredible. Yeah, and we have a full line of rentals. A lot of them are brand new. So if you get up there right now, you might get foot in a brand new wow. boot. Wow. You know, and they're exceptionally good rentals. That sounds amazing. Yeah. Unfortunately, I'm over 16, but I'm sure the deals are still great. And that sounds like a, I mean, every time I do the report with you guys and I, we come across the soup and bread thing, I'm like, I like this. I like this place. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Everybody likes homemade bread. Exactly. Yeah. And my brother's right out there now. He groomed up oh, probably over 60% of what we have open was groomed already, and he's still out grooming now. But uh, he won't get done probably until around 11 today, but it'll be fantastic. Oh, good. Skiers are just amazed how good it is. Well, it's, it's easier, I think, to offer a family-friendly operation when the family is working together itself on the operation, right? Yes, it is. So it's your brother oh, that's yeah. out there grooming. My two brothers. My other brother does lessons. Oh, good. And so we are doing, we do the full service thing. You can get a lesson. You get your rentals. We do a learn to ski package. And you can just show up and have a good time. That's The other awesome. thing we are is very dog-friendly. Oh, good. Yeah, well-behaved dogs and well-behaved dog owners are oh, welcome good. to come and ski on our trails. <laughs> I love that you added that. <laughs> well, the dogs are easy. <laughs> yeah, it's the owners, right? <laughs> but no, they yeah, actually, most just about everybody that brings a dog is used to, you know, dog etiquette. And that is very good. 
that's great. Yeah. I love to hear. So that really does make it family friendly because the dog is part of the family. Oh, of course, man's it is, best yes. friend. And uh, you know, it, dogs love it out there because they get on the groom stuff. They really don't make any prints any worse than a skateboard print. Yeah. You know, so it's it's an excellent oh, thing. Oh, wonderful! Yeah, yeah. I definitely want to come down and check it out. I've only tried the skate cross country skate. I haven't tried the track set yeah. yet, so I'm kind of curious. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm gonna have to. Well, come on out. We'll yeah. set you in a set of pair of rentals. All right. You can get going. That He's got good. the tracks out there. They're really I good. I know. Today. It sounds <laughs> like it's good conditions today. <laughs> yes, it is. And we're waiting for another snowstorm, but it's just gonna be. We'll get more terrain open as soon as we get another storm. Okay. Awesome. Yes. Is there anything else you want to mention before we head out? Well, just I guess the scenic and simple. I I didn't stress that we have some of the most scenic and simple river trails around. Oh. You know, a first timer, even if they didn't take a lesson can glide out to the river and it views are oh, fantastic That's right, because the river's right down there. That's right. So yeah, oh. it's beginner friendly and it's it's so beautiful. You, you'll, it'll be an experience you'll never forget. I love the sound of water That's right. out in the woods. So you add that with the cross country skiing. You're absolutely right. And you're it's, gliding on the street. It's audio visual oh, out there. And, and, and you don't think of it until you're there. But the sound of the river gurgling by you, it is so relaxing. It's very meditative. Yes. I like this. All right. I just want, okay, I'm done for the day, Chris. We're going to go cross country skiing. No, I'm just kidding. We're still here. <laughs> Maybe a little bit later, yeah. but it's been so great to talk oh, with yeah. you, Doug. It's so nice to meet nice you. To Thanks yeah. for coming on the show, oh, telling yeah. us about it. I love hearing all the details, you know, well, getting into all the details. Get back to work now. Uh, back to work now. Well, I'm going to have to head by and visit you. Thanks okay. so much for being on the show. Stay tuned. We'll be right back with tons more prizes, a lot more information. Make sure you stay tuned.